Hello everyone, welcome back to another Photoshop tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to do a neon glow effect very quickly. Let's get going. I'm going to delete all the layers here. Bang, gone, starting from scratch. First step, create a new layer. Now, go to your elliptical marquee tool and just drag out and drag out an elliptical marquee just like this. Let's go with something this size for why not. Now, we want to go to edit and we want to go to stroke. On this stroke, we're going to go with a width of 30 pixels, color, we're going to go with a neon color, so we're going to go bright ass green, something like that. Okay, good enough. Click on OK. So we've got our neon bright ellipse. Now, the next step is we're going to go to select, deselect. Good. Now, we're going to create a copy, and I'm just going to drag and drop it on this plus, and we're going to call this one glow. Okay, just for the giggles. This one, we're going to go ahead and apply a Gaussian blur. Filter, blur, Gaussian blur. We're going to go with a blur of 100 click OK. Now take the layer one, make another duplicate copy of it. Go ahead, go to filter, blur, Gaussian blur, and this time we're going down by 50. So we're dividing it by two. All right, now there's our second blur. Go to the layer one, drag and drop it again. This time filter, blur, you guessed it, Gaussian blur, 25. And slowly but surely, let's do one or two more maybe. We're going to go layer one, put it over the plus sign filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur, let's go with 12, and then maybe let's keep going down to 6. Why not? Filter, Blur, Gaussian Blur, 6. Okay, good. So we've got some blur action going on here. Now we're going to take all of these glows, and we're going to go ahead and we're going to merge them. So we selected them all, right-click, and we're going to go to Merge Layer. So it's all one fancy layer. Excellent. Now take this glow layer, and make a duplicate copy. This is going to make it extra <laughs> extra bright. And now we're going to apply a blur to this one. So the top copy, go to blur. And now this is the one where we can sort of dial in how much of a blur and a glow we want. Let's go with something like, let's see what this looks like. Okay, that's a bit much. Yeah, maybe something like, let's go with 12, okay? Click on that. Presto, this is a neon glow using Gaussian blur. That's how you do it. Thanks for watching.